All right, what's going on, people? It's your boy Smack Kings here. All right, I'm going to be doing something a little different this time, which is uh, I'm going to be doing a character review. I normally don't do reviews of characters, so um, I'm not very good at being um, doing reviews or whatever. So just bear with me here. I'm just going to give it my best and try it out. But the character I'm going to be doing a review of that I have been doing some research today and I have to stumble upon and um, that character would be Virgil. Okay, so we're going to get started here and I'm just going to um, pick, pick a character that would be like a, a good test dummy for him. Um, you know what, I, I actually will roll a house. I gotta pick a stage where I can actually see in the air. Um, yeah, I'll pick this stage. Okay, okay so I have stumbled upon this Virgil. It's actually the, the ultimate Marvel vs. Capcom 3 version of, version of Virgil. But the thing is, he still has a couple of his um, Devil May Cry stuff still added to him as, like, you know, if you guys happen to see. So like in a, I think in a, um, one of the Devil May Cry versions of Virgil that's, that plays exactly like Devil May Cry 3 but this one has the Ultra Marvel Cry 3 stuff. Okay, so I'm gonna demonstrate some of the stuff he has. You know, he still has his regular attacks and his launcher. And also he has some type of weird move. If you press the, I think the circle button, like you see what he just happened, he just shot out a projectile. Like one of his swords, you keep tapping it, he shoots that out. But you gotta wait for that blue bar over there to um to, to load back up. Alright, so he got a super jump. Um, of course he could run, that, that's his dash. And when he dashes back, he actually teleports, which is pretty cool. Alright, so let's see if we can get like a, see what the combos look like. Alright. Okay, that's a one, two, three hit combo there. So let's try, let's try this. Let's try that that that, that combo from Marvel Three. The one, two, three, four slash, which that actually works too, because he also got his four slash here. All right. So, but not to get anybody confused, but we demonstrate one combo that he has. And then he also has his moves. You know, the the sword slashes. That's the medium one. Fierce one. Okay. And let's see what else he has. Oh yeah, his teleport moves. Of course. Just like Marvel 3. Which he can come from the air as well. Alright. And he has the other move, which I forgot what it's called. But it's the move that he slashes across the screen, which is has that. Which is pretty cool. Okay. And he also has his cartwheel. You know, the cartwheel he has. And also his his uppercut kick, but then he has something else where I don't know. I think it's uh, I don't know if it's a Devil May Cry attack, but if you hold Daniel down and hit Fears, I believe it's has a launcher kick. But the cool thing about that launcher kick, it can actually juggled only three times, no more than that. I actually thought it was like a broken infinite, but it's not. You only juggle him three times, so. Okay, so, and he also has his, you know, of course, you know, downward slash, his, um, what do you call it? His dive kick he has, of course. Um, what else he has here? And also that, he has basically his Marvel vs. Capcom 3 attacks, though. So let's see, okay, as I showed you guys earlier, you know, the one, two, three hit four combo, so let's try to see if we can combinate everything else. All right, so let's go one, two, three, four. Oh, wait, hold on, messed up. All right. Okay, so we combinate all that. And that's another thing I wanted to show you guys. See what I just did? Let me just launch them for now. Slash, slash. And it can still hit them, which I think that's really cool though. Even though it's Mugen, but I think it's really cool that he had that added to him. He could do like a double slash. Okay. Oh yeah, I forgot one thing. Almost forgot. You know he also has that the, 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 the sword throw thing. When you hold down any attack button and he glows and then lets it go. 
which it does like mad freaking it's like crazy but you know that that's how many well it doesn't do that many hits though in marvel 3 I, um you know if i'm not mistaken but okay so now let's get down to the supers he, you know he has okay he has that super yeah okay he still got that and he also has his spiral swords but I don't know if you can actually do that. What you call it, Dane? Let me, let me see. Like you know when he uh, activate the spiral swords and he can actually, you know, target the match. You see if, he, if I can do that. If I can remember which it is. I don't really don't know how to activate it. In th this version of Virgil, I don't know how to activate it. So I really don't know how. But okay, we all know he has this uh, spiral sword stuff, and he also has the double trigger. And we all know. Course, you know that's always gonna be original. So he has all his Marvel vs. Capcom, Ultimate Marvel vs. Capcom 3 supers. So we all know that for sure. Okay. And not to forget, he also had if I can activate it, X Factor. Which is still which I don't know if it does, you know, quite a amount of damage. Let's see. Let's just do a random super and see what happens. If it does some damage. Well, yeah, it does. But the X Factor wear it off. But okay. So now you know he has everything. Now I'm gonna try to see if I can show up a little more, a little bit more combos here. All right, let's see something. Let's do this. So one, two, three. Okay. One, two, three. Oh damn! Just stop lagging, cause you know. All right. It didn't combinate though. But I try to combinate all that into the spiral swords. All right. Let me try again. Four. Ah, damn, messed up again. I'm trying to accommodate all that, but if I can't, I'm just gonna go with the flow. <laughs> all right, try it again. Well, you know, I try to pull off a you know a Marvel's Capcom Three combo there, but even though it might, it's kind of lagging on me, so I'm just gonna try it again. If it doesn't work, then you guys get my point, right? Because I know many of y'all play Ultimate Marvel's Capcom 3 already. I know what Virgil's about, so. <laughs> okay. Hmm. Alright. Ah, the car wheel wouldn't come out. Oh, well. Let's try it on the other side. Let me try something different. Ah, damn. Hmm, that was kind of strange there. I'm gonna look into that. I just did a jab right after the fierce. Oh. Well, I didn't meant to do that though, but <laughs> I was trying to do the uh, one, two, three, sword slash into the spiral sword, see if that works. Get on the other side. This thing is like really lagging. Right. I don't think that combo's over there. Okay, let's try that again. I don't think it combos, but let's just try this combo here. Oh, I forgot to do the what you call it. Okay. All right, yeah, okay, cool. That's what I'm looking for. Let's try that again. Oh. It's like some of his attacks is kind of like a little delay for some reason. So it's like you gotta wait like a like a split second to let the, the blast hit count. Okay, even though that combo was fast, because after the um after this kick, he can't really super jump, so he can only jump mid-air and kind of, you know, cut him up and bring him back down and stuff like that. It doesn't, you know, it's like this Virgil here. It's pretty good, but it still needs some work. You 
Okay, see, we got it. All right, so now let's try that other combo again. The one, two, three, four, stab into the spiral swords and we can get that to work. Oh no, whoops, wrong game. Oh, but now we know that that works because I can launch him right back up and, you know, bring him down, of course, you know. Let's try that again. Let's see if we can get that out again. Ah, damn. I hit the wrong button. Another thing, too, that I should let you guys know, see, the button attack is pretty much still the same, but the only thing that's the problem is that, um, okay, you know, like, this is my jab, my medium, my fears, this is my launcher. So I don't know why, you know, the, the whoever designed this version of Virgil designed the button system like that, because normally, you know, the Mars Capcom 3 originally set out, I guess, for the arcade stick. The um, launcher button usually would be here, depending on how you set the buttons in the real actual game, but my launcher is here, so I gotta remember that my launcher button is my roundhouse kick. So that's how I have to do it. Ah, you see that? <laughs> that's the thing though, it's really confusing, but you guys get, get what I mean. You can launch them back up, do an air combo, bring them back down, you know. All that good stuff with Virgil, you can still pull it off though. But other than that, you know, it's, it's pretty, it's pretty decent. I wanna, I wanna, okay, yeah, I wanna, I wanna test out a combo that I did earlier. Hmm, that's, okay. Okay. I'm trying to get the hits to count. <laughs> Wow, let me find out that's like a broken infinite combo here. Alright, let me try to see if I can time that. Time that again. Alright. Ah, oh, damn, this thing is lagging. Okay. Okay, I guess you can't do no more hits after that, though. But let's see something. Let's try that combo again. I mean, it's an interesting combo. Luckily, you can't like repeat it back to back. That would be fucking too cheap as hell. Too cheap as hell. Damn it. Ah, the timing on this shit. <laughs> Uh, I don't know. I can't get the hits to like count, you know, that well. But we all, we, you get, y'all guys get what I mean about it. But like I said, so far it's pretty good or whatever. It just still needs a little bit more work, but it feels okay. I was like, you know, let me just bring, you know, Adam in here because since I do play with Virgil and, and Ultra and Mars Capcom Three, so I'm like, let me just add him into this music. You get what I'm saying? Let me see something with this kick. Okay. Let's see what we could do with this launcher kick. Even though we know we could juggle only three times with it, you know. <laughs> Alright, but I wasn't trying to do that super. I was actually trying to do the, the, the spiral swords, but that wouldn't work. But let's see something. Oh, man, messed up. Went too fast. Ah, damn it. <laughs> I don't know, it just went, it, well, it's not coming out for me. This thing is like... No, not that super. Well, yeah, it's a little hard for me to pull on certain combos because you know, I gotta worry about this thing, you know, lagging and buffering or whatever the case may be, so... Well, other than that, you know, that, like I said, that's my review with Virgil so far, so... 
Yeah, I just want to give a little demonstration on how he is or whatever. Like I said, this is my first character review video, so if I don't, you know, if I don't do so well, if I did or not, you know, like I said, people just bear with me or whatever. I try to do the best I can to show off what I, well, you know, this Virgil. But like I said, you guys would get the point. If you ever happen to find this version, you know, y'all probably, for those who play Mugen out there, if y'all come across this version of Virgil, y'all see what I'm talking about. Maybe I could come up with some crazy stuff or whatever. But all right, but um, that's gonna be it for now. Until next time, you know, I, you know, I do plan to maybe do a playthrough for him soon, but I don't know just yet because I have, you know, other playthroughs I want to do on my own. So, but you know, I hope you guys really like the video. If y'all like the review video, just leave a comment below and just, you know, leave a thumbs up if you like the video. Be sure to subscribe to the channel, and I shall see y'all next time. Thanks for watching. Peace.